Hey, Garfield Memorial. I'm so excited to be here at Aviva Church with this pastor, Lumar Vargas, who's going to uh, bring the word to us today. Um, what an amazing, what an amazing outpost for Christ on the west side. Terry and I were cried our eyes out <laughs> at this service. Um, they dedicated children, the youth were leading. It's really, really amazing. So Lumar, tell, tell Garfield a little bit about Aviva Church. Yeah, I um, I thought a little bit about, about the question of like our story. Um, I guess I'll start the moment where I was telling God why I wouldn't plant Aviva Church. <laughs> I'll start there. And I remember driving um, down Cleveland, on the west side of Cleveland, and seeing churches on every side and hearing God call me to, to plant, call us to plant Aviva. And I was saying no for all of the reasons. And then God was like, hey, in, in the next 10 years, you're going to know exactly why this church needs to be planted. And then he just put on my heart that the next generation of, of Latino pastors specifically were going home. And in the last two years, we've seen four, Pastor Chip, we've seen four of our pillar pastors go home and be with mm -hmm. the Father. I mean, these are seasoned leaders 30 years in. Um, and so we're here in on the west side of Cleveland, just being faithful to the call. Um, being obedient to what God is doing and trying to do that with all of the generations and our young people, as you saw today. Amazing. It's amazing. Garfield, we need to invest in this ministry. We need to partner with Aviva Church. Uh, this isn't the future of the church. This is the present of the church. It's a church right now. So what do you think are the next steps for Aviva? What do you, what do you sense in God saying to you right now? Yeah, um, we... As we as we walk towards the new year, we launched in April, and so as we we look at to the new years, we want to have strong families. I mean, as, as you saw today, strong families, strong um, marriages, um, ministries for kids. I'm thinking so much about how I just had the opportunity when I was a little girl to preach when I was 14 years old, wow. and so God um, just dropped in my heart like. What about a class to prepare the next gen to to discover their call and their vision to speak the word of God, and so I'm I'm working on that. Like, what would it look like for us to have um, classes for kids to discover their call now and not wait until much later, um, and youth and and for us to holistically the whole church for for everyone to to really discover their calls and just put it to work so that we could be ascending church. Praise God! Hey, Garfield, get ready to hear an amazing word from God. Thank you.